Okay, this is Mario once again, and I've been trying to work with this machine here, and it just not it's not cooperating. Uh, I did it again. I re um, resliced this file just in case, in case there was something wrong with the file. But it got even worse. Look at look at this. This is not an issue of the the slicer, because as I was printing this. Uh, all these parts that you see here, which came out horrible, worse than the uh, than the other video, part seven is going to be part eight. Horrible, horrible print. As compared to the prints that I get from my Anticubic i3 Megas, I mean, look how beautiful these parts are coming out. Uh, let me see if I can zoom in on these parts so you can see that it's not an issue of the file; it's an issue of the machine. focus in on those parts and you can see every layer every layer is being deposited perfectly you know it's the same geometry there are no missing layers the machine is consistent these machines are consistent uh, that's what I've, I've been saying any cubic uh, you know with all these new machines that are coming out it just seems that you know in, in order it seems that you know we're going back and in, in, in uh, instead of moving forward with some of these uh, machines and companies that manufacture these machines you know they they should you know they have so much information with these previous machines that do just fine and these these this is a machine that has no bells and whistles it's just a basic uh, just a basic touch a sensitive uh, screen in the front nice and clean solid solid machine and and I, I can't I can't say this is enough. I wish Anacubic would not have pulled away from, from this architecture here because these machines are, are great, great machines. Yeah, I, I've had issues with the, uh, uh, with the maintaining these machines. Uh, you know, the power supply went out on, on most of my machines. I, I repaired that, but this is what I'm talking about. This is where it counts, you know, consistency and layer uh, the, the position here of the, uh, of the filament, you know. So I'm just doing this to prove a, a a good point here and just to show the comparison between the the same file that's been printed printed on, printed on this machine I'm getting tired of talking because I've been you know making all these videos here and just trying to get that other machine to perform you know to at least to the level of this uh, machine that's a lot older than, than the other one so I don't I don't think I'm gonna get any any further with that other machine with the uh, um, artillery sidewinder uh, X3 Pro, uh, you know, it's supposed to be a, a pro, you know, even the name Pro it should, it should, you know, should give you, you know, a, a little more reliability, being that they're naming it a, a Pro machine. I said it's not nothing Pro about it. I mean, just just look at how beautiful these parts are, layer by layer. And I have done thousands, thousands of parts on these machines on the Anticubic to to uh, sell with my products. And here's another part that's been done. Uh, you know, just just great, great machines. Uh, you know, I could. Um, I mean, that's the reason why I kept these machines. I, I was going to sell at some of these machines just to uh, uh, upgrade them to uh, some some newer 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 machines. But considering what what is out there, there's no way I'm going to get rid of these machines. No freaking way. And uh, people that have these machines should keep these machines. Watch this video and keep your machines. Keep your Anticubic i3 Megas. You're not going to beat these machines. Even this one here, which is a uh, a very very entry level machine, which is uh, by Monoprice, it's one uh, one of the, the smaller versions, uh, um, Monoprice uh, something ten. Even this machine with my own plate here, with my own phenolic uh, uh, sheet here over the, the metal plate, is a lot better than than this uh, Sidewinder uh, X3 Pro. Okay, so this video should solidify, you know, what I've been saying from the beginning of this machine how how it uh, you know looks is not it's is, is not a, a um, you know one should not go by looks although i didn't go strictly by looks i you know i, I was hoping that this machine would uh would be somewhat uh, reliable considering the other videos of the previous models that some people have said you know the, the um, it, it, you know there was um there, there were better machines and so
you know, I, uh, I, I can't, uh, I, I can't, you know, there's no way, there's no way, just, just by showing you the comparison between this machine and the other one, that I, that I would, would keep a machine like this. There's absolutely no way. So, this video should solidify, you know, my, my comparison and all these things that I uh, have been uh, saying, you know, from uh, the first part of the videos, all these video segments. This is a uh, video number, uh, probably seven or eight, I think. So, you know, if you want to comment, comment below. You know, I'm, I would like to hear from somebody else that has this machine or from the company itself. So I'm open for that. Until then, uh, I, I think I'm. There, there's no way I can continue with this machine. So I think this is probably going to be the last video, as far as this is, uh, this this uh, particular product is concerned. And this wasn't supposed to be a product review. I'm just showing you know what the machine uh, uh, can do from somebody that works day in and day out. You know with uh, with with making parts. I make parts. A lot of parts for sale. I didn't buy this machine to make parts for sale. I bought it more for um, so that it, it would. Um, uh, be able to print uh, some of the larger uh, uh, items that I want to print for fun for my grandkids, but there's no way that I can keep this machine, you know. So I'm I'm, I'm very 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 uh, very unhappy, very very disappointed, and I I mean I try my best to to give this machine a a, a fair shot at, but this this is what it's doing. There's no way I can keep it. Mario with the Miami Microflight. Thanks for watching.